Hello YouTube, I'm back with a, an auction win here. Uh, I'll start off first with a, a 1993 set of mites. The Ricky Rudd card in there I don't think is authentic. It doesn't look right compared to his uh, other autographs, but it was in those cards come out in 93, so that might have been like a TTM maybe. Next set is the 91 Max. Uh, I might later on take those two sets out of the packages. The boxes are kind of rough. Maybe put them in a binder like these others. And this next set is in a binder. The cards are, I mean, uh, the binder's a little dusty. I guess they were on the shelves for a while. It's the 92 set. And let's see what we got here. This one's a little dusty. The 90. They're still there. The 90. 1990 set. Yeah, I've seen that set enough. I already know by heart. And we'll get into the the better the better ones here. Uh, name of this video is like. I named it the Deja Vu video because, let's see, it was last year, I think it was, or, uh, that I got these next two in an in in auction win. And uh, this is the set that has the Dale Earnhardt rookie card. It's the 90, 1989 set, yeah, it'll be the 89 set. A little off, been fighting off the cold. Can't seem to shake it. And uh, probably the best, the best set in the lot. And you guys have seen these before. And it's the 88 set. But there's a catch to these. The, these include the uh, variations. I think they're called the Myrtle Beach. Variation. See on this checklist here, you can see it says the 10, 10, 10 cards, 10 cards there, and I guess the Myrtle Beach variation says the 100 collector cards. And there's throughout the set, there's some variations like uh, one will be easier to show you here. It would be Daryl Waltrip's card. And the variation for it would be this one here. Same number. And let's see. Let's find another one here. There's a couple with checklist variations. Hey, here's one uh, that has. There's another one. That's a Brett Bodine, and the variation will be that, that card there. There's the, the best card in the set, I would say, the Dylan Hart card. And, and I got that whole lot for 20 bucks. So I thought that was a steal. But this week, I got a box of NASCAR programs. There's some pretty good stuff in there that I'm going to show in a later vid. I did miss out on an album with some cards and some signed index cards, which I'm kind of kicking myself in the butt for that. But, uh, you know, there's two Richard Petties in there at least. There was a signed hero card. And, and an index card and one that I've been trying to get there was a signed index card from Junior Johnson but you know you win some you lose some I guess well that'll do it for this video thanks for watching